Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you that how you can add tabs in your product description of the Shopify store. So currently on my screen you can see that I have description, specification and policy. So here you can add different tabs uh, for your description. So currently you can see that I can able to add the images, text and if you can see here we can also uh, load the video which is auto playing video and then we have the description where we have list so you can add according to your requirement so if you will go to home page so here you will also see that I have already added that same product on the home page and that same tab is showing on my home page as well so this is looking beautiful and this is specific for the debut theme so currently on my screen you can see that this is the debut theme which I have installed for other themes I will also upload the videos so if you have installed debut theme then this video will be useful for you so let me remove all the code which I have already added and then let's uh, again add the things step by step so that you could get to know that how you can do it by your own without knowing anything about coding so firstly you should go to actions the here you can see that this is the dashboard of the theme we have debut theme installed and here you should click on actions then click on edit code and once you are clicking on edit code then you will be redirected to uh, files and folders of the backend so here you can see that we have layout templates sections so you need to click on layout then you need to click on theme.liquid and here on uh, you need to find actually head tag so this is the close head tag and just above I have just added uh, this code which I had required so I'm going to delete all the code from here and let me save these changes and then after I need to refresh this page again so if I will refresh you can see that everything is as it was before so now I am interested to uh, also remove the product description so let me remove the description again so here you can see that I have this t-shirt product and here I have added actually the description so here you can see that I have added the video I have added the image so these things I am interested to remove again and you need to add and remove by clicking on this show HTML because this is the original code which you need to copy and paste so first example I am going to remove this, uh, this uh, thing and let me save these changes yeah now you can see that we no more able to see the description of the product alright I have just refreshed and uh, clicked on preview and now all the changes has been gone so first example I am interested to add it again so here I have the uh, file which I will be uh, uploading and you need to download I will be adding the link below in the description so the step one is paste below code in product description so here is this code and this is the first step so I am actually going to copy this code and let me paste it over here and make sure that you should click on show HTML and here you need to paste so if you want you can actually edit this text from here for example you want uh, something else uh, in place of description maybe specification policy or uh, for example you want a different list here and if you want you can also remove this image and uh, change the link of the image according to your own uh, image and here we have the uh, video so if you want you can actually replace the URL of the video uh, for, for now I have a dummy video and you can actually replace it with your own video and here we have some other text which you can actually uh, modify and then after you need to save these changes and before doing anything you need to go to uh, layout then click on theme.liquid and here you again need to find out head so here we have a head tag open and head tag close is down below here you can see that we have head tag close so this is the head tag close all right forward slash head so just before this head tag we need to add that code so this is the second step actually paste below code in theme dot liquid just above close head tag which is which is looking like this all right so i'm going to copy this whole bunch of code from here let me show you and I need to actually select all these things I'm going to copy this this stuff uh, but make sure uh, you need to do one more thing actually 
here I have the style actually uh, this is the designing part I'm going to copy this and then I need to paste it here all right I pasted it and then I need to uh, copy the JavaScript so here we have the JavaScript so I'm going to copy this from here and I need to add it just below all right let me save these changes once you saved and then you need to actually uh, see the preview so for say example I am seeing the preview and now you can see that this is reflecting that means this is working fine so for say example this is not working then you need to add one more thing which is this actually this is the script which is uh, jQuery library so if the code is not working then you need to copy this again from here and paste it just below this just below this script tag all right but for now that is already uh, added so I have no need to add it here all right but make sure that if, if something is not working then you need to paste that same thing here and then click on save changes and then again click on preview and now you can see that here we have everything working fine so here we have the video we have the policy we have the description so if you want you can actually add uh, more tabs as well First example I am here with policy and maybe you are interested to add something else this will be tab 4 for its example and I have policy and then uh, for this example I am adding terms and again you need to add one more div for the tabs for this specific thing so here you can see that tab 3 class tab and I am going to add a new tab which will be looking like this so this is tab and this is tab 4 alright and inside of it I am going to close this again the tag and then inside of it I am going to add one p tag which is paragraph alright and inside of it I can uh, write something else for example I am uh, adding here here is the terms and conditions of the Shopify store alright and now you need to save the changes and then click on preview let's see how it will look so here you can see that we have terms if you will click on that then you can see that here is the terms and conditions of the Shopify store so that means this is working fine so in the same way you can actually update or maybe you can add something new so this is really simple so I will be adding the link below in the description so you can actually explore the things and uh, use it in your own store if you will go to home page then same thing must be implemented here so here you can see that same thing is uh, reflecting on the home page as well why because I have actually added the same product on my home page as well if you have a different project or product then maybe that will not show because uh, this design is implemented to, to the specific product where you have modified the things all right so for this example you want uh, a different uh, you want the same thing for the second product so again you need to click on product and select the product and paste the same thing over there and that will show again uh, in the same way which we have done just now so this is really simple and interesting as well because this will attract your customers this is quite eye catchy and if you want you can actually change the color so you can hire me for that uh, I will be adding the contact details below in the description so you can connect me uh, whenever you want so thank you so much for watching this video if you are thinking this video was useful then please like this video also subscribe this uh, channel and feel free to ask the questions if you have any suggestion you can also comment me below in the comment section so that I could create the next video for for that thank you once again see you in the next video